Welcome to Flash University. This time we're going to take a look at how to troubleshoot a low DC notification on a Vanguard 370 system. If the status shows a low DC notification, then the controller is not providing enough voltage to operate the tower lights and PLC circuits. Check the blue power LED as this is a voltage indicator to let you know that the system is operating with full output voltage. Once incoming power is removed, the LED should turn off in about 5 to 10 seconds to indicate a full power discharge. However, you should never solely rely on the lamp for voltage testing. Use a voltmeter before servicing the equipment. With power turned off, check these four points for proper wire termination. Turn the system on and check for approximately 58 volts DC on TB2. If the output voltage is not in the correct range, power the system off. Wait for the power to discharge and remove the red and black wires on TB2. Turn the controller back on and retest for 58 volts DC. If the voltage has returned to normal, suspect damage on the tower, including but not limited to a short on the LED flash head cable or poor wiring terminations in the flash head or marker junction box. If the voltage did not return, power the controller back off and remove P3 from the surge board. Turn the controller on and test for 58 volts DC on pins 1 and 4 of P3. If the voltage is still not present, replace the power supply inside the controller. If the voltage did return, replace the PCB2 surge board. Contact technical support for any additional issues.